Hey, SpongeBob, what's wrong? Hey, Patrick. It's just that it's nearly Christmas and I'm feeling like I'm missing something. What do you mean, SpongeBob? You've got all the presents you could possibly want right here. The Homer Simpson Advent Calendar, the iPod Touch, the Arcos 605 Multimedia, and this big box of chocolates. What else could you possibly be missing? Well, isn't Christmas time supposed to be about family coming to over to visit? Well, you've got hers, and my cowboy cousin Patron is coming to visit. And I've invited my cousin Sophia to come join us for Christmas. <gasps> Sophia's coming? Oh boy, 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 oh boy. Calm down, Patrick. Sorry, it's just like the last time I saw her was before I went to Mallorca. Really? That can't be true. I recently saw a picture of you and Sophia and Deviant Art. Well, yeah, but... Well, I guess I could always invite my Swedish cousin Sponge Hands again. Wait, do you mean that guy with glasses? Yeah. Well, I'm inviting my nephew over again, Krabs Jr. I just hope he's got over his iconic like, obsession by now. Every time he came over, it always used to be Miranda Cosgriffith and Jeanette McGurley that I couldn't take it. Sounds a bit like S.B. Rasmus if you ask me. Yeah, but not as geeky. You've got that right. Hey, I heard that. Here they come now. Hello, SpongeBob. Merry Christmas, yeah? Merry Christmas to you too, Sponge Hands. I'm so glad you can make it. Me too. It would be miserable around here without me around. Heck, if it weren't for my last visit, you would never have confessed your love to Sandy. Will you quit going on about that? I'm sorry, SpongeBob, but you two just seem to make a cute couple. Ugh. Sophia! Sandy! It's great to see you again. Merry Christmas! Same to you, Sandy. It's been so long. Yes, yes it has. Oh my gosh, Sophia's here. It's me, Patrick. Patrick, oh, I've missed you so much. <gasps> you have? Yeah, and I can tell you've missed me. I've watched your SpongeBob episodes and I noticed you've missed me in various episodes. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, aren't they sweet? I find it disgusting. Hello, Uncle Krabs. Oh, hello, my nephew. How are you? Oh, I'm alright. I've just been watching iCarly recently. Oh, don't tell me you're still obsessed with iCarly. Yep, and I love it. So, um, SpongeBob? Yeah? What do we do now? I, um... You know, I hadn't really thought of what we would do now. Right, well, uh, I could always get some mistletoe for you to kiss Sandy under. Don't even bother, we've already done that twice. Great, so are you two a couple now? Nope, I think it's just best to stay friends. That's what you're saying, but I bet your heart is telling you otherwise. You don't even have a girlfriend, so how would you know? Past romantic experiences, min absorberande vän, förbi romantik. Um, you know I don't speak Swedish, right? So, hey Patrick, what have you been up to lately? Oh, uh, not much. What about you? Not much. I recently went to see an animation tour in England, though. Hey, I did too. That's odd. I swear I saw someone that looked funky there. Well, it was probably someone that just looked like me. Hey, what about me? I'm still here, you know. I'm sorry, uh, who are you again? <sighs> Why is it that I'm always ignored? Ah, uh, don't worry, Patrang. It's Christmas. I'm pretty sure Patrick's got you a present or something. Ha, present? For that idiot coin in the far one, he hasn't got a job. Ha, ha, oh, oh, oh. I deserve that. <sighs> ah, the Navidad. Ten of the new most power fell apart enough for me to the Jesus. And don't forget all the free presents from Santa Claus. What are you wishing for this year, Patrick? I want another piece of paper. I hope Santa gives me a lifetime supply of free Krabby Patties. Free? Well, if Santa Claus gets you that, he's gonna have to pay for every Krabby Patty you eat. I want every single iconic DVD. And to meet Ryan Akasko from Jet McCurdy in real life, that would be awesome. Well, I'm hoping to get a copy of He-Man on DVD. I'm hoping to get an iPad too. 
Normally I'd want peace and quiet, but oddly enough, I've learned to enjoy Christmas for what it is. I'm not feeling the Christmas spirit at all. Ah, oh, come here, you big look. I'm sorry I ignored you before. Ah, oh, that's right, amigo. Now I feel happy again. Oh, everybody's feeling happy. Even I'm feeling happy for once. I'm glad to hear that, Squidsy. But I never got my Christmas wish for loads of money! <gasps> a bag full of money! Thank you, Santa! Well, I still never got my piece of paper. <gasps> wow, a whole notepad of it! Thank you, Santa! Speaking of paper, did you notice someone on the Deviant Art drew a picture of me and you? Yeah, I wonder why. I'm guessing you two are getting more and more recognised as a couple. Kind of like my cousin Stanley's squirrel girlfriend. But unfortunately, I don't have a right to say the name of the couple. It's kind of weird that all their relationships involve squirrels. Speaking of squirrels... What did I tell you before? And so it came, for all the captains had a very Merry Christmas indeed. Patrick got the intention he wanted, Patrick got to see Sophia again, and got the paper he wanted. As for Spongebob, he decided to just stay friendly with Sandy for the meantime. Squidward still misses borders. Yes, yes I do. And I got all the money I wanted, so, from us all at Spongebob Pits, we wish you a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Boy, that was a cheesy ending. You're telling me it was rubbish. <laughs>